Hello everybody! Today's video is what's in my diaper bag. What do I hold in this diaper bag for all of my six children? Um, this has stuff that can that literally has things for each of my children. Um, yeah, not too much for my bigger two, but for my little four, my youngest four, we have a lot of stuff in here. So let's get right into it. <laughs> so let's talk about this diaper bag first. I will link this in the description box below. I absolutely love this diaper bag. I've raved about this so many times. It's inexpensive. It is like $35 off Amazon. They have all different prints. Um, I love that it's waterproof. I love that it's lightweight. I love that it's a backpack. I love all of the pouches. Um, I love that there's like metal boning in the top to keep it open. My favorite thing of all time is the back pouch so you can reach things from the bottom of your diaper bag instead of having to pull everything out. So highly, highly, highly recommend this. Please check this out in the description box. I don't think you'll be like sad if you got this. <laughs> all right, so let's, let's open this stuff up. So um, we'll work our way out and to in what do you think okay i'll start with that so first thing is out this is where i keep all of my snacks um i would say the one thing about this every bag it doesn't really hold like bigger bottles like i have the como tomo bottle i can't remember what i think is what you call them they're thicker so that really wouldn't hold in these pouches but the thinner bottles would thinner bottles would so just if you have big bigger bottles they won't fit here but if you have thinner ones they're, they're insulated pouches so it's very nice um but this is where i keep my snacks so i have these are like i'm in the car a kid's freaking out i have snacks lots of snacks um they just fit right in here and they zip up there's lots of pouches um and they know where the snacks are because it's, it's easy because the bigger kids know where they are so they can come in here and unzip it themselves if they're looking for something which is handy dandy um here i keep like an extra toy like if like a baby's upset like this is like a light up toy or griffin's upset or they need something to do as a button toy um i try to keep like one toy in this bag for just emergency sakes usually i don't use it but just to have something just something and now here is where i keep my huggies natural scent free wipes that i absolutely love um i never really use the like the white container pouch thing i know a lot of people do but i never got into that so i usually just pull them out but that's where i keep my wipes uh, what else there's one more pouch but i don't think i have anything in it let me check i haven't opened this one in a long time Do I have anything in here oh yes okay i have a lip gloss for emergency lip glossness and napkins paper towels so like like bounty paper towels if i have an emergency which is crazy i totally forgot i have these in here so i'm really glad i'm really glad i did this video so i can remember if it was an emergency with napkins i know where they are now yay mom brain <laughs> all right so let's open the diaper bag there are two zippers and uh, it's just full to the brim and see how it stays open it's glorious it's just glorious so first that i have a sippy cup i always bring at least one sometimes i bring three griffin y'all know has angelman syndrome he can't really suck too well um he does better with like these kind of cups or like a more of a sippier cup but straws are really just they don't really work too well for him so we always bring a sippy cup for griffin no matter what um clothes i always bring a change of clothes for the babies um until they're out of diapers, until they're solidly potty trained, um, there'll always be an outfit for them just in case because I've been places where I didn't bring clothes and there was an accident and yeah, let me tell you, that was not fun. So I always bring a clothes, an extra change of clothes for my kids that are still in diapers or potty training because it's just not worth the risk. So yeah, I got Miss Lindy, a little footed onesie, um, Griffin and Sawyer pants and shirts and then we got posy pants and shirt and then so that's the clothes so that's where we are now and then i have lindy's one bottle that i use that i bring with me and then i have the formula container which i got this with amazon it's awesome it doesn't break i got one off at walmart this is like my fourth one I've got, but I actually, this is the one that has not broken on me. The one at Walmart, the little flippy top always breaks. This one does not break. So check this out. I hope um, this will be in the description box. Really, really like this one. A like chewer toy for Griffin. Um, just something with his Angelmans. He likes to chew on things. If he needs something to chew on, we have something for him. Um, a pair of sunglasses for me if I need some. Again, forgot they were in here. <laughs> 
um, an extra pacifier. I usually throw even like, like, two or three in here because you know how you lose them. So definitely need a pacifier. Um, and then I have um, disposable bibs. These are handy dandy. When I remember to buy them at the store, I buy these and put them in my, in my diaper bag because um, Griffin usually rips them off, which is a shame, but Posey and Sawyer, these are really good for. And especially if they like mac and cheese, like this is really good to have. So I think I got these at Walmart, but I bet, I bet you can find them anywhere. All right, and then we have my thermos. Now y'all probably going, why are you bringing a thermos with you? Um, Lindy likes warm water with her formula. Um, she's not drink, she's not drink uh, cold water with it. So we must bring warm water with us wherever we go. Um, yes, I, yes, I can get it at a restaurant, but sometimes I'm not at a restaurant. So I always just bring this anyway, just so we don't have any problems. So that's why we have a thermos. I remember we had to do this with the twins and that was a feat. We had to bring two of these wherever we went. <laughs> and it was, it was awful. Yeah, that looks, these were, these are heavy, man. <laughs> so yeah, so, yeah. Um, a bottle of water for whoever needs a drink. Always, always have a bottle of water with us. And then, what else? Oh, I got more. Oh, this is, no, this is, there's a bib in here. Another bib. Bib packet. There they are. So I got more passies for whoever needs one. And then we got some socks for whoever needs socks. And then we have the changing mat. Yeah, we'll see that. You never know when, when, when you're going to need it and where you're going to change your diaper. You need it in the car, in the grass, wherever you need, you need this. Okay, and then, um, oh yeah, I've got another outfit. It's actually Lindy's outgrown, so this won't work anymore for her. Hey, I'm cleaning my diaper bag out. This is awesome. Thanks, guys. <laughs> and then we have diapers. So many, so many diapers. So many diapers. Like, it's crazy, Tim. Like, this just showing you how many we have. So many diapers, so many diapers. Yeah, that's it for diapers. I need to put more in there actually, just to be safe. More socks for emergencies. And then, wait, a change of underwear for Win and socks for her. Um, and my last thing I have in here is my first aid kit. Yes, which I've never had to use and hope I never have to, <laughs> but I keep them with me just in case. This one I always stick at the bottom of my bag because I know I can reach it quick quickest because I have that secret backpack, which I'll show you after I put back in here. So, put those back in here. Oh, get back in there. Get back in there. Yeah, so here's that secret little handy dandy pouch, pouch, pocket. So you can rip out and then you know, like there's your first aid kit, you can rip it out quickly and then you have just your diapers right there. So usually when I do a diaper change, I unzip, I grab the size I need, zip, zip it back up, then I grab the wipes on that side and then I'm good to go. And usually the changing mats kind of in the middle. It usually, yeah, I can grab it from either side, up or bottom, my changing mat, so yeah. So that is that. So that is my diaper bag. That is what's in my diaper bag. This is what I, how I survive when I go out with all my kids. Um, yeah, it's it's chaos, but it's awesome chaos. <laughs> um, we do need to bring a lot of stuff, but we've definitely mastered it. We've learned the hard way, what to bring and what not to bring. Um, Yes, we were that parents that brought everything in the beginning and then we we're the parents that brought nothing and then regretted it. So we're trying to just be that that middle ground and try to remember, you know, at least one thing of we might need, you know what I mean? Like one thing of everything we might need, I don't know. We're not perfect, but we're sure trying. <laughs> So that is it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. Thumb the video for us. We'd super appreciate it. Follow me on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter if you'd like. And we'll see you next time. Don't forget, guys, you're wonderful. Bye. Bye.